The following video shows you normal operation of each rotary test position. The rotary test selector switch is located on the right side of the center pedestal. Its function provides a means of testing the visual and oral warning systems. A red light above the test selector switch illuminates whenever the test selector switch is in any position but the off position. The first position is the smoke and detection position. You will see in here both master warning lights and a double chime and a red baggage smoke cast message. In the landing gear position, you will see in here the three green landing gear indicators and the unlocked light will illuminate. Be aware that if the flaps are less than 24 degrees, a warning horn will sound. Also, if both throttles are less than 30 degrees and the radar altitude is valid, including the radio altimeter being less than 500 feet, a warning horn will sound. In the fire warning position, you will see a red engine fire left and right cast message, an amber fire detect fail left and right cast message, both master warning and master caution lights, and both left and right fire push lights. In the thrust reverser position, you will see all six thrust reverser indicator lights. In the flap position, you will see and hear an amber flaps fail cast message, both master caution lights, and a single chime. The flap reset switch light will illuminate momentarily and the ICAST flap indicator changes from white to amber. Next, before you rotate the switch into the windshield temperature position, make sure the windshield switches are on for this part of the test. Please be aware that with the rotary switch in the windshield temperature position and the windshield switches on, the rat heat is enabled. Now with the windshield temperature position, you will see in here the amber windshield heat in op left and right cast messages, the amber windshield over temp left and right cast messages will post momentarily along with master caution lights and a single chime. After the test is complete, turn off the windshield switches. In the overspeed position, you will see and hear an amber FADEC fault left A and FADEC fault right A cast messages, a cyan FGC ADC miscompare cast message, and the overspeed oral sounds. Display 1 will indicate the following with no air data flags. The altitude will indicate 1,000 feet. The VSI will indicate a positive 5,000 feet per minute climb. The airspeed indicator will indicate 350 with a Mach number of 0.79 and an ADC test. Note. B FADEC faults can appear with a reversionary message. This is acceptable provided faults and reversionary message clear after the rotary test is complete. Next is the AOA. It is important to remember that the rotary test knob must remain in the AOA position until the AOA test is complete and a column stick shaker turns off. This tests both the auto slap fail function and minimum speed functions. During the test, these items should be watched. The three lights in the AOA indexer shall illuminate one at a time during the test sequence. The AOA indicator shall slew to the zero end of the scale. The AOA indicator off flag shall be displayed as well as the following cast messages. Amber stall warning left and right, amber AOA probe fail left and right, and red minimum speed. After a few seconds, the AOA off flag shall be removed 
and the indicator will move up scale. As the pointer approaches 0.60, the indexer lights, if installed, shall cycle from yellow to green to red. At approximately 0 0.80, normalized angle of attack, the stick shakers operate. Make sure the vibration from left stick shaker is felt through both control columns. The system should return to normal operation after a few seconds. Note, an amber AOA probe fail left and right and a red auto slats fail cast messages will appear if hydraulic pressure is available. The slats will also deploy during the test. For the enunciation position, the engine shutdown inhibits are removed and all enunciations associated with master warning will occur except oral signals, which are muted. EGPWS and any optional equipment oral alerts will sound. Slide slope. Pull up. Wind shear. Wind shear. Wind shear. Terrain. Terrain. Pull up. Runway. Awareness. Not. Available. A red hydraulic pump fail A and B and oil pressure low left and right cast messages. An amber fuel pressure low left and right cast message both master warning and master caution lights, along with instrument panel lights and any optional lights. Finally, with the switch placed in the off position, the test is complete. If you have any questions, please contact Team 10 1-888-622-4700. Four seven eight nine, or at three one six five one seven five six five zero, or by email at citationx at txtav.com.